Hey everyone, happy holidays from Lake Nona, Florida. We're here on this beautiful day in December. We're gonna show you this home behind us, but before we get started, my name is Mike and welcome to our channel. Now, if you haven't done already, we're getting very close to 25,000 subscribers, so we definitely appreciate it. Me and Haley, who is filming today, that you subscribe to our channel. So let's talk a little bit about the home behind us. It is built by Toll Brothers, one of my favorite builders. It is a five bedroom, five and a half bath home with 5,801 square feet of living. The base price as of today, which is December 19th, 2022 is going to be $1,428,995. Now that's the base price. It does not include lot premiums or upgrades. Lot premiums here, about half a million dollars. So to get a home like this with the beautiful entryway and bathroom that we're going to see as we walk through here is going to be about $2.8 million. So let's go ahead, take a tour of the outside and go inside and show you what we have inside. So currently we have a walkway here going to the other model, but when they sell the model home, they'll change us into a nice paved driveway. And of course the paved driveway will come up to a four car garage because we have two car garage on the right. We also have a two car garage on the left. Really nice stonework and of course a couple carriage lights on either side. We come out to the entry. It's very modern with this overhang coming out and of course the covered patio area with the French doors in front of us. So let's go ahead and go inside and show you this beautiful home. All right, so welcome into the entryway of this home as I close the door behind me. We'll talk a little bit about how, why this entryway, of course, as soon as you walk in, that's the first thing that you know is how grand the entryway is. And of course, on the floor, we have these gray tiles that's surrounded by a little bit darker gray rectangle that goes all the way around. And of course, on either side, we have stairways going up to the second floor, has a walkway across. And as we look up, the ceilings are extremely tall with this floating ceiling coming down and these light fixtures that look like bubbles coming down and floating down from the ceiling. And on either side, we do see a couple statues of people People diving into the entryway, which is really cool. And of course, all the wood work going all the way up to the second floor. So as I come this direction, we're gonna go over into the family room and show you how grand the family room is. So this is just so so much space. It's 5,801 square feet, but look how much space we have going up as well with these really tall ceilings as we come over to the family room with a nice built-in shelf going all the way around. And of course the floating shelves. A good ladder to get up to that storage. And of course, we see that same woodworking going all the way up to the ceiling. Talking about the ceiling, the ceiling is a tray ceiling with a floating feature coming down with those bubbles as well that we saw on the front entry also. So the uh, actual living room has these really nice couches in a round shape. And of course, we do have our sliding glass doors here going out to the outdoor living that we'll show you later. So let's go ahead and go over towards the kitchen area. But before we get to the kitchen, we have this little nice living area here where you can sit, read some recipe books, get re really ready, or have a nice little uh, pre-dinner drink if you want as well. So, and then of course, we do have our kitchen. The kitchen is currently set up with the center island here, has four seats. And of course, this really beautiful solid surface stone counter that goes throughout the kitchen. You'll see it here on the center island. And then of course, as we go over to the counters on the other side, you'll also see it over here. And also the backsplash is that same beautiful design with those natural uh, designs going through it as well. We have our cabinets, cabinets go all the way up. And then of course, we have our refrigerator, a couple double-sided refrigerator here. And then as we continue to go around the other side, we do have our microwave. Right by the microwave, we do have a pantry. It's a walk-in pantry. Currently it's locked so we can't see, but you can actually look in there and see plenty of shelves, plenty of storage for all your dry goods. Now, all the cabinet work continues to go all the way through. And as we continue, we come up to our range. It's a six burner gas stove top range with an oven down here, two ovens, and of course the air vent, venting all those smells outside. Now on the other side, by the center island, we have our dishwasher. We do see we have our sink and of course faucet, nice high quality faucet there. And then we continue with plenty of more storage and cabinets going all the way over to our dining room. So here we are in the dining room. It's a very spacious dining room, currently set up for 10 people to sit around. And of course you have the views of the pool and of course the pond behind us. And then we do have the sliding glass doors and check this out, look how tall these sliding glass doors are. If I'm standing next to it, I'm six foot tall. You can see that they are very tall sliding glass doors. So let's go ahead and go over the other direction. Now, before we go over towards the primary bedroom suite, we'll show you a little secret room that we have right around the corner here. So as I come this direction and go right, the first thing we see is we have a little Harry Potter room here. They have a golf bag just displayed there. Of course, it's locked as well, but plenty of storage there for all your seasonal stuff. And then we have our half bath. Half bath has tile going all the way up to the ceiling, 
course, a mirror, pedestal sink, and toilet. But what's really cool is where it's right next door, we have a little hidden office. So you come in here, nice built-in cabinets. And of course, there's a really nice gray countertop as well, where you can sit here, get all your office work done, or prepare your recipes if you're into cooking. So follow me in this direction. We'll go across and go across the hallway. Now, if you haven't done already, make sure you like subscribe to our videos we definitely appreciate that both me and Haley who is filming today we have another storage area here currently has two suitcases there and of course that will be changed to a solid door and then we come over to a our primary bedroom suite so very spacious area nice ceramic tile floor going throughout of course you have a king size bed I love the end tables here really good design and of course the accent wall behind it. I love the gold and grays. Goes really well with the picture that they have on the wall. And of course, above us, we do see a tray ceiling that does have some crown molding and then this light fixture sort of matches the same sort of light fixture we saw in the entryway, those bubbles coming down as well. So as we go this direction, we'll show you what I think is one of the best parts of the home, which is the primary bathroom. So follow me this direction. And the first thing we're gonna do is go show you the closet. So we're gonna go ahead and go right. Uh, this is one of two closets here. This is the bigger closet. You have plenty of space here. It goes all over the corner, as you can see. So, and this is, these are really nice uh, uh, closet hardware here, but what I would probably do is redo this whole thing because you have so much more space that's just not being used right now, going up and you can fit so much more stuff in the closets. And the same thing for the other side. This is a little bit smaller of a closet, as you can see. Um, but the same thing here, you could change this into a California closet and probably fit three times as much stuff as you see here with these, uh, the setup that we currently have. So as we come this direction, we go from that gray ceramic to this really interesting flooring here, this tile floor. They have, it's bigger rectangles, but they have smaller designs in each rectangle. I think that really, really stands out. I think that's beautiful. And of course it goes over to our garden tub sitting right in the middle of this very spacious bathroom. Behind the garden tub is the shower. We'll show you that in just a second. But then over to the left, we do have one sink. And of course the solid surface counter is going all the way across beautiful cabinets and the mirror that's got the frame of woodwork around it and of course light fixtures on either side and we do have a window on this side of the room as well as we come over we go into the shower shower is also very spacious couple shower heads and we have the porcelain tile goes all the way up to the ceiling as you can see and they are tall ceilings so you have plenty of space here. They have two shower heads, so you can have two people in here showering with the controls right in front of me here. So come this direction, and what we'll do is we'll see the other side. Now the other side also has cabinets, and then we have our makeup area with the mirror, and then we have the sink with also the mirror with the light fixtures on either side. And then of course, on the other side, we do have a water closet as well. So follow me this direction. Let's go ahead and go back towards the entry of the house. Now, if you are, a uh, agent that sells luxury homes anywhere in the state of Florida or anywhere in the nation and would like us to feature your home on our channel, uh, let me know. Give me a call at 407-487-3030. I'll be more than happy to talk to you about featuring your home on our channel. And of course, if you're looking to buy or sell anywhere in Florida, be more than happy to talk to you about that as well, whether it's here in Lake Nona where I can help or one of my partners throughout the state of Florida. We have some amazing team that can help you find a home, whether it's one like this or a starter home as well. So here we are uh, in the office. I love this little office. It's right off the front door, so it's nice and convenient for deliveries. We have our desk chair. I love the built-ins, and that's one of Haley's favorite features. Of course, if you watched our channel for a while, you'll know Haley is my daughter, and she loves to read books, and she loves when she sees bookshelves like this. She likes to actually have one in her room. Um, and then, of course, we have a bench area, um, and also, this design on the wall with a 3D woodworking coming out of the wall as well. I think that's really neat. And then uh, following the theme of the home, we have these globes coming down from the ceiling for the lights. So next one would be bedroom number two, which is down here on the first floor. So you have two bedrooms on the first floor. Right around the corner, we do have another storage, a storage area here with the bathroom that I'll show you in just a second, but here is bedroom number two. Currently have the bed here, a couple end tables on your side, wallpaper going throughout, of course, this headboard going up. Really cool light fixtures going across as well. And then right behind me is a closet. It is a walk-in closet. You can walk in and check that out. And then, of course, if I go the other direction, this one is his own suite because it has its own full bathroom. So as I come in here, we change from tile, from that grayish tile to a little bit lighter color tile coming in here. Of course, we have the nice cabinets, solid surface countertops, the mirror, the light fixture, 
We do have our shower. The shower, I really like this tile. It's really interesting design. As the tile goes up and you see the grays with the gold, that matches really good with the other accent tiles that go around it as well. So follow me, we're gonna go ahead and go across the whole way. Now, if you are looking to buy, um, we do have a website in the description below where you can go in there and log and do your own searches. For resales, you might not find these new construction on there. That's something that we can help you with. But for resales, we do have a search site below that you can use. As we come over to the laundry room, here we are in the laundry room. We have our washer dryer, plenty of built-in cabinets, even have a sink. So everything that you sort of need for the laundry room. And then we do have on both sides a two-car garage. I'll show you what's in this, this one's, they're both being used for storage. But if I show you, you can sort of get an idea of the actual space in the two car garage as I come in here. Um, both, both garages are the same, but as you can see, they currently have it for storage, but get you an idea. They do have the epoxy floors on those garages as well. So let's go ahead and take a walk across the hallway. This gets you a really good view of the entryway as well. You see our dual divers, one on this side, and we have one behind the camera as well. And of course the dual stairs as well. As I come on the stairs, we changed from that ceramic tile to solid wood. And then what's really nice is how these railings are done. Nice metal railings with the glass inserts going all the way up to the second floor. So let me go ahead and go upstairs. I'll meet you up there. All right, so here we are on the second floor. Of course we come and we see the hardwood floors going throughout the second floor. And the first thing we have is the loft. It's an extremely spacious loft. And that's a common theme throughout this home is spacious. We have our couch, really beautiful artwork, of course. And then as we continue, we see we have the chairs, a coffee table. Then we go on this side, we have some built-in shelves, plenty of storage, huge TV there as well. We even have some more cabinets on this side going up and a little office so you can sit here, get your homework done, schedule your week, everything right here as well. And then we even have more built-ins with a bench underneath the window. And then as we continue to come, we do have another built-in bookshelf, Haley's favorite, of course, going all the way up to the ceiling. And then we do have Bedroom number three behind us. So let's go ahead and go into bedroom number three. We go from the wood floor to a really nice high grade carpet. And here we are in bedroom three. So nice bed, we do have an end table and then we have a little desk on the other side. And of course the wallpaper behind the bed, which is really neat and a light fixture above us. Plenty of windows for natural light as well. And of course a closet on the other side so as we come this direction we do have a bathroom right next door so this will be the bathroom for the loft or bedroom three we have a cabinet of course countertop with a sink mirror light fixture and then a walk-in shower and then a toilet behind us right next to the window so you have some beautiful views while you're using the toilet so anyway as we continue to come back here we'll go ahead and go across the walkway so follow me this direction as we come through we get to see the beautiful entryway and also family room as we go across the walkway so as they come this direction we look to our right and we see the entryway with that floating ceiling and the beautiful glass chandeliers coming down and of course the two divers on either side of the entryway and then of course on the other side we see that floating ceiling as well with the twin light fixtures and the family room below us with all the built-in shelves and the woodworking going up to the ceiling so follow me the direction we'll go ahead as the second staircase we come up to a storage closet, which is where the air handlers are. And then we'll go down this hallway to two more bedrooms. So we'll go ahead and go to bedroom number four. Let's go ahead and go this direction first, for bedroom number four. We go back into the nice plush carpet. This one's where I got peachy pink colors, bed and table on either side. Nice light fixtures that come out on either side of the end table. I like how the design behind the, the headboard with the woodworking and across with the two different colors, the peach pink color and then the white color on the other side. And that goes all the way over onto this other side as well. We do have a walk-in closet. So you have plenty of space here to store all your clothes. And then right around the corner, we do have our own full bathroom. So as we come this direction, we move from our plush carpet to this really cool tile. They're squares with little patterns throughout. I love that tile, it's really nice. And of course we have the cabinets, solid surface countertops, mirror, light fixture, toilet, and of course the tub with the tile work going all the way up 
to the ceiling. And then if we go this direction, we get to see the final bedroom, bedroom number five, right across the hallway. So as I come over here, we of course, we have the plush carpet as well. We have our bed, we have our desk, we have our end table. This one's got some cars as far as the theme of the room with a really neat uh, picture of the car that's camouflaged with flowers and one of my favorite Lamborghinis right there under the car meet. Of course, if I look at the room itself, the walls are really neat because they go up and then we have this really cool gold color that goes all the way around the outer edge of the room and of course the light fixture with Edison bulbs right in front of me. Behind the camera is going to be the actual closet so we can see that as well. You have plenty of space and then we do have our own bathroom. So this is a suite. So as we come into the bathroom, the first thing that you're probably going to notice are the floors. The floors are penny tile, really neat floors and of course we have the light color wood cabinets countertops, sink, mirror, and the light fixture. Now over here, we do see that we do have a tub and then the tub has this really neat uh, gray tile going all the way up to the ceiling that's sort of surrounded by uh, like a sh shadow of black. That's pretty neat as well. So let's go ahead and go back down the hallway. And I think we have one more thing to show you. So follow me this direction. Now, if you are looking uh, to purchase a home, we'll have links below for some other new construction in the area. So if you're looking for your typical starter home, we'll have a link to a channel where we have that as well, because this channel focuses mostly on luxury homes. But as we come over here, we do see we do have our family room. And then beyond the family room, we see our outdoor living with the pool and also pond. So let's go ahead out there and show you that. All right, so here we are on the outdoor living. The first thing I notice as I come out is what's below us, which are the beautiful stone floors. And of course, in front of me is a eight person dining room set for enjoying the eating outdoors on a beautiful day like today. And then as I look up, we see that we have very high ceilings here, same sort of height that we saw in the entryway and also in the family room. And then it levels down a little bit and comes over to a covered area where they have four lounge chairs. So if you want to enjoy a little bit of shade in the Florida weather, you can do that over here with the four lounge chairs. Or if you wanted to, you could just step out and enjoy the actual Florida weather as we step down into a sunken living room as we see here. So as I come down, we see that we have a seating for four. We have a fire pit in front of us. You can really enjoy nights here with the fire pit on or during the day with a beautiful view of the pond behind us. So let me go ahead and go up. And then what we're gonna notice is a really cool pool, a uh, jacuzzi. So this jacuzzi is one of the biggest jacuzzis I've seen. It fits a lot of people's like little swimming pool and then it's divided by this beautiful tile work. And then we go into the actual pool itself. The pool is pretty long. You can do laps back and forth here. And of course we have these water features coming out throughout the pool as well. And then at the end, we do have a tanning shelf with three lounge chairs in the water. Absolutely beautiful to sit out here and enjoy the Florida weather as we have right here in December of 2020. So I wanna thank everyone for watching. If you are interested in purchasing a home anywhere in the state of Florida, make sure you give us a call. Either myself or someone on my team will be able to help you uh, find the right home for you. My phone number is 407-487-3030. You can call or text anytime. Thank you all for watching and see you in the new year.